I just saw someone stumble out of the crowd uh, in front of me across the street. This was on Commonwealth Ave, probably about a half mile from the finish. Um, she was in track clothes and wearing a number, but I thought someone had just sort of stumbled into the race. Maybe somebody was a little crazy or something. Women's winner in the Boston Marathon today with a time of 2.31 and change. Now, we don't know how many seconds that is. It may be a new American record. Um, what, was, what was the time in your first ever marathon, and where was it? It was 2 hours and 56 minutes and 33 seconds in New York last year. And so you improved from 2, two hours and 56 minutes to 2 hours and 31 minutes. What, I what, guess so. <laughs> what do you attribute that improvement in time to? Um, I don't know. Uh, have you been doing a lot of heavy intervals? Um, someone else asked me that. I'm not sure what intervals are. <laughs> what are they? Well, intervals are, are track workouts that are designed to make your speed improve dramatically. And if you went from a 2.56 to a 2.31, one would normally expect that you'd do a lot of speed work. Is, is someone coaching you or advising you? Uh, no, I advise myself. <laughs> well, it was a fantastic performance, Rosie. Congratulations. Rosie Ruiz, the mystery woman winner. We missed her at all our checkpoints. She came through the finish in a fantastic 2.31. We have to confirm that time at this point, but she was way ahead of a world-class field here today in the Boston Marathon. Thank you, Rosie. Thank you. In the end, she was...